During this quarantine period, people have found themselves with a lot of extra time. Some people have taken advantage of this by doing fun and interesting things. Paige Dickinson has enjoyed makeup for many years. She is now using this time to develop her skills. I originally started doing makeup in seventh grade. Like I've been doing it for a while. I'm a really creative person, so it's like another outlet to work on stuff. So yeah. Paige has also tried many new looks. Over this break, some of the looks I've done, I've done a galaxy look where I got make like face paint and I would just paint on the galaxy. So that's one of them. Another one I did a James Charles inspired look where I did the this cut creep glam type of look and then I get white face paint put like my mouth down to my like collarbone area and then get foundation and drip it so it's more like some abstract looks but yeah those are some of my looks I've done. Madison Boring has been spending her time writing the novel she has been aspiring to write for a long time. Um, I've been wanting to write this specific novel since ninth grade and I have not found the time or the drive like, or the energy to like actually put forth some work. And I figured over quarantine, like we have so much more time to do, do stuff that like it would be silly to let all that time go to waste. And so like I actually have time to sit down and like work on what I want to. Madison has a few ways of going about organizing her writing. Um, I have two different documents set up to help me organize. So whenever I have bursts of inspiration that like I know I'll forget if I don't write them down, I write them in my notes document, which literally looks like I'm schizophrenic because it's a bunch of phrases and stuff like that, that remind me when I actually have time to sit down and write about them. And then I have my draft document where I write scenes out separately, where I can go in chronological order or skip around a little bit, and I can write down how dialogue should happen, what kind of settings and things like that. Gianna Hoover has been expanding her photography portfolio over this time at home. So Grant, my brother, he's really into fashion, um, so, and I love photography, obviously, so we kind of took our hobbies and put them together. Um, so it's pretty mutual. We are really good friends, like we hang out all the time, so it's pretty chill. Even though there are limited places you can go, Gianna makes the most of it. Originally, when this whole thing was not as um, severe as it was, we went to Lancaster City um, and kind of were there, was there for a little bit and left. But now that that's not the case, we just go around my house. There's like woods across the street that we can kind of work with. Whether you want to be a photographer or even a makeup artist, take it from these girls. Now is a great time to get started. From Hempfield Happenings, I'm Grace Monis.